If you're thinking vacation thoughts as you get that coffee going and maybe the toast down, it is the first official full day of spring since it did come in yesterday evening. And we had a great day yesterday. It wasn't uh, as warm as we're gonna be today, but it was still beautiful with all that sunshine, right? Today will be milder and you will definitely notice a difference. Even this morning, we're feeling much more seasonal and I've got an outlook that I know that's gonna make you smile. So if you're away from the TV, it may be Gather around for some good news over the next few months as we see our average temperatures really starting to warm up. 30s for most of you this morning, a few of you in the 20s inland. It is 41 degrees downtown. Winds are pretty light this morning, so we're not seeing a big difference. Unlike yesterday, it was much more breezy where we had a lot of wind chills that were dipping into that teen range. That's not happening today, so that's another big element. You still need your coats, obviously, heading out the door as you're leaving for work this morning, getting the kids to the bus stop. We're going to see a lot of sunshine to start and then more just partly cloudy skies into the day, but we are climbing into the 50s. So it's going to be milder with more overcast skies later in the day, but still dry. So if you're thinking about you know, this evening and once you're home or if the kids have practice of some kind or you've got things to do later on and, you know, you're meeting up with friends, it is going to be dry through the evening hours, through the evening hours. I'll explain more in a moment. We're definitely seeing that surge of milder air, though, on the map. It's pretty evident with a lot of 40s and 50s. Average high is 49. We're going to hit 54 today at Hopkins. And here's what I was talking about. So today's average high is 49, as I mentioned. By next month this time, it'll be in the 60s. By May 70s, by June, July, we're in the 80s. You see that beautiful little trend that's gonna be happening over the next several months. So up, up, up we go. And as far as down in the sense of precipitation, we're not seeing anything in the area today, but there are some rain showers to our south and west. And that is what we're tracking as we head through the next several hours. On our national design mode forecast, nothing through the day. We will see that cloud cover increase this evening, but watch what happens overnight. You'll be sleeping while this does. We do see a few rain showers move in overnight, 3 a.m. tomorrow, that's the view. They're in and out of here real fast. And then as we head through your day, tomorrow we're basically left with perhaps a sprinkle, but more or less overcast skies otherwise. Back in the 50s, 60s on Thursday. That is warm for this time of the year. Dave will have showers, thunderstorms, cool it off behind the front, and then it looks like some spring showers as we head into the first part of the weekend. And again, no 30s on the top. There. And no snow. <laughs> yeah, there. Let's, I mean, oh. we, let's be honest. Yeah, yeah no snow. Absolutely. Holly, thank you.